In this question, we have to find how many test cases are needed to achieve 100% decision coverage. And then these options are provided. To do that, let's first analyze the code and draw the flowchart. First line is if p equals to q. Since this is a condition, we will represent it like this. Line number 2 is s equals to s plus 1. Since it is a statement, we can place it like this. Line number 3 is if a is less than s. It is a condition, so we will draw a flowchart like this. Line number 4 is t equals to 10. 